Hi all and welcome back to this newest episode in our Transport Fever 2 series where we play in Scandinavia and the Baltic States. Um, last couple of ep episodes we uh, have been setting up our uh, first train line as you probably remember, the wood transport line over here and also the other wood line over here. Yeah, there's something with uh, wood and stuff, yeah you know, things like that, moving logs, moving planks. Uh, after that I kind of saw that the profit I was making wasn't that much, especially if I wanted to do any other stuff. So I kind of expanded a few lines and uh, from there I just stopped the date and I let it run for a very long time. Um, and now we have some money as you can see. Um, so we can finally do some more and that is more or less the case why I made that call in that matter. Uh, the thing is I do want to have some more trains because yeah that's kind of the main thing. And now we have two possibilities where we can start working on and that's this connection over here, the query to the construction materials plant and then we can have a line bring the uh, building materials to Tallinn or the oil transport between Ulu, Wolu, Hulu, <laughs> sorry, and the Kiruna uh, oil, oil refinery. Um, I think this one is easier to set up and I think we should definitely work on that one. Um, <coughs> and especially it's also one of the routes that you will have eventually over here concerning train travels and as we connect in the cities they will pass by here as well so i think it's good to have at least something set up like that and then we can always afterwards go to this one but but i do think it is going to cost some money of course which is quite obvious um, so the first thing i just say like just let's just start building and see where we will end up uh, that's one. Uh, let's see what if we place it over here. Something like this. Because then, if we have tracks going down, they can just easily pass by, you know, and then uh, things should be worked out that way. Oh, yeah, that's not going to work, of course. Uh, Will be a difference. I just go like that. So just see how far we come. And we have to go around this city, and eventually this will change, of course. As we will have a train station here eventually. Um, and that's of course a little bit of a weird turn to make. So let's try to do them from here on already. That's probably better. As I said, it will change eventually, especially when we are building the train station over here for the passengers, for the passenger lines. Let's see, yeah, that's fine. It will probably change eventually, also with other streets and, of course. Uh, other crossings or even tunnels or yeah, you never know of course uh, this is uh, hold on let's see because I want to build a station on the outside because that's the best spot to build it at this very moment so let's just place the station over here and from there on Let's see if we can go straight. 
Yeah, the speed is alright. Oh, I think it is. Okay, then we just can continue building from here on again. I think we can we do go down a little bit. Or not. I'd like to see if we can... Uh, eventually this will... I have to put these turns over here, you know, that will change also. Turn the speed, but that will be... You really get to trains who can handle that speed in turns because, yeah, that's also one of the things as well. You have to think about them. Let's see, where are you over there? Okay, yeah, going up slightly is all right. I don't really mind, I just don't want to have a uh, Yeah, all right. Oh, yeah. We don't really have much of a choice, I guess. All right. So that part is in. I'm not going to do anything concerning those things yet. Just placing the depot over here. So it's also because then the. Say it. That the factory or the oil well in this case has has some time to uh, produce a bit. And I really don't know which door is going to be used over here, but is it that bad? Mm, no, it's fine. Alrighty, so let's see that will this will be our second train line. Um, for now that will be the Ulu Raw Oil, I guess. Oh, crude oil. That was the word I was looking for. <laughs> right, it already sounded wrong. But yeah, sometimes you have to make those mistakes, right? Crude oil. Um, let's just change his name to Oily Oil Well. And maybe call this. For now, just go refinery. Oh. Maybe in the future, uh, we can say maybe in a goods hub or something like that, depending a little bit on if anything will be transported that way. For now, it will just be dead. Um, let's see. Think car, like you can bring five, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I think we just have to see and try, right? See how far or how fast it gets, especially over here. Oh, alright, so that is a good thing. It's already, uh, already bringing in a lot.
our second train already. Let's hope this will this will give us <coughs> a little bit um, more and a higher income. <coughs> I do think that is necessarily or necessarily <laughs> necessary. Um, so I'm really wondering how much that one is going to earn. <coughs> so we'll just let it drive. So I have a capture right at another moment probably. Don't know if I will do that right away with all the trains I'm setting up of course, but <coughs> for now this is what it is. And then I'm also going to take a look at uh, lines over here. See how are you doing? Okay, that's fine. Mm. Hmm, one over there as well. Let's see, yeah, this one's way closer. It's going pretty fast. Look at him go. He's going up here a little bit. So I'm coming into the forest. There he comes. No, oh, well, let's hope this will be a profitable line. I really hope so. Really, really hope so. That's not bad. 450. I can live with that. This is waiting here now. Oof, it's a lot. Alright, well, I think I know what I'm going to do here. I'm going to add the second train already. Uh, we just have to set up some bypass tracks. Um, let's see. I think one over here. Probably one over here that will be eventually be inside the station. That should be okay, shouldn't be a problem. That. Should be right. As I said, I will probably it will it will be double tracked eventually. So then we don't need any um, bypass tracks and stuff. Oh, that is one thing. By the way, I have to uh, take a look at at what. Uh, sides to trains drive in Scandinavia. This might be a different side. The train drives in. Let's see. Trains drive left. Unlike the roads, roads in Sweden use left-handed traffic for trains because Sweden drove on the left until 1967. Railways did not switch because any of the time at the drive seat on the left side. The signals are normally located to the left and hence are easier to see. Okay. something to find over here because for me I have to think about of course to work on different lines in different countries um, so what sites do they drive in Norway yeah, that's the right side I think Yeah. 
Alright, so what are we going to do? So Sweden is left, but this is not really Sweden, we're now in Finland of course. Um, no, we are just going to drive on the right side, uh, because that works properly. So now this should work, so that's one. And the other one was, a, was planned over here. Oh, okay, I don't know what that was, but okay. So that's one. And as I said, that will eventually, when we build the station, here, somewhere, over here, or over here, whatever, I, I don't know yet. It will have some bypass tracks in it, so then that whole problem will be solved immediately. Uh, one way, yes. Okay, so now we have those in, okay. Oh, that's nice. So we can also start thinking about upgrading. Oh my god, there's so much waiting here. Mm, what if we extend you a little bit? Will that be too... Yeah, it will probably take a lot of time to get to speed, as you see. But I do think... No, 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 no. We're just going to leave it like this for now. Do speed up. And then it's somewhat in the middle. Then I will just clone it. <coughs> and then it's kind of fingers crossed. Yeah, that's so, that's so well. This will be a better money maker than... Um, the other one. So that should work. No, auto save. Because, yeah, if you look at it, 450, 279, so. And he's almost getting to the station again. Yeah, uh, for now they just have to wait. Eventually, I can just make this, for example, longer, so the whole way, and then eventually things will work out. There we go. Yes, this will this will be fine. This one will do great. So we have now two trains on the same track, so that's good. Let's hope that we are able to uh, upgrade them uh, pretty soon as well. <coughs> uh, maybe they don't even have to wait that long on each other. Because mm. he's going in there now, they are kind of arriving there at the same moment. we go so well maybe this all works out pretty nice and then we can start making some money and then slowly paying back our debt because that's also important to me as well um, not that it's it's that much but um, it's like 90k as we have 9 million um, in debt, so it's 90k a year, I think. So for now, it's just mainly making money and paying it back. Ooh. Okay, I didn't saw him earning money, but I guess he did.
anything. Well, it's uh, fine by me, but at least you're making money. That's the most important thing. Okay. Yeah, okay, this is fine. I don't really mind. This will work out. All right, so let's see. Let's oh no 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 no. Just keep on running for now. Um. That one is doing great, and this one as well. Let's see, oh, yeah, there's this route over here. We've got some stone waiting here as well. Let's see how many trucks do we have in here. Okay, ten. So what if we decide on replacing them? With these, it's going to cost me three twenty one. Mm -hmm. Copper, oh, yeah, this counts the same one as that one. Stone and bricks, yeah, let's change those. And eventually we can do that with kind of everything. Ah, this is way more funnier to see, you know that with those rocks. <laughs> ah, that's way way more fun. And you see at least what they were transporting, you know? It's really, really nice. And they are doing great. That, that is a good thing of, of those drop-off points. They have to drop it off. And it's good to see that it's getting to its fullest. So eventually we can, you know, it's not that they are pretty full, right? No, it's fine. Just let it go for now, it's good. Uh, but eventually we can, uh, <coughs> if you bring in more stone, for example, we can also Start bringing it to Copenhagen or Copenhagen. <laughs> that's kind of it. <coughs> so that's that's fine. Right, those two are doing great. It's just kind of waiting on better trains. That would definitely help. Anyway, um this is it for this episode already um, if we keep on going like this then the next step will probably the train line over here the transportation of the stone towards the construction material factory and then connecting Tallinn to it as well by truck or car cart um, so that will be probably the next step especially now that we are making some decent money See loan interest is of course the investments we had to make but still we were able to make a good profit there so I am uh, positive about the future and once we are making good money then we can start, and pay, start to pay back the debt and maybe I decide to do that as well uh, as just let the game run for a while you know so that's when we have, for example, uh, we have now like almost one one million. That I decide to let it run up to ten million, pay back the loan, and then we continue playing. But I will see about it. I'm not sure how things will go, of course. Anyway, um, next episode, I might decide to do a uh, cafe ride again. Because that are funny short ones to work on and at, at normal speed of course so it might take for example this one to there and then back because we aren't connecting to this point yet I think that will be then I will losing money because of the distance uh, and I think that will be a different line because it will also be able to bring the fuel back to Congas and then go back over here that's probably the most logical way to work that one out it will be interesting 
to get to those cities but yeah that is why I like to have mountains hills because it's extra small challenge to work with so yeah uh, again thank you for watching we were able to uh, set up this new line and let's hope that uh, we can start building more in the future so thank you for watching and until the next one bye bye